The cast and crew of All My Children would like to dedicate this episode to the memory of our beloved friend, Mary Fickett. Jake, I'm telling you. I mean, every week's like clockwork. On Sunday, Mom and Dad usually call up for an update, you know, and so I haven't heard anything all week. And I've left messages, you know, starting to get concerned. Right. Well, I say don't worry about it until there's a real reason to worry about it. Yeah, well, you're a big help. I'm going to keep trying. Has Jake heard from them? Nothing. I don't like it. Oh. oh. Whoa! <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> what the hell are you doing, period? Didn't you get my messages? You scared me to death. Yeah, I didn't get any messages until after I landed. And I was so close, I just... I couldn't wait. Uh, it's surprising. Yeah, <laughs> mission accomplished. <laughs> what you do with that? They are trying to get me. I mean, there's one right there. Okay, I'll have the doctor on call take a look at you. I want her to examine me. We know each other, don't we? Or did we? Uh, I, I don't know, maybe, possibly. I wish I could help you. I can't examine you, though. I'm not on staff anymore. But you're a doctor, so you can treat me. She was wandering through the town square. Someone called an ambulance. They're everywhere. They're trying to get me. He could be one of them. You can't let them get me. I mean, I'm Erica Kane's daughter. Uh, but you're, you're actually going to be okay. He's not one of them, uh, whatever that is, and... You're, you're going to be fine. Just uh, do me a favor, Anne. Let's find her a cubicle and I'll go say goodbye. You're going to be just fine. We're going to take very good care of you. You promise? I promise. A lot of kooky characters here in Pine Valley. Dr. Ponce. All right. Dr. Ponce. Honey. Hi. Hi. Guess what? What? The loft next yeah. to us is for sale. Is that right? Hmm. So the old lady, she and... You don't like our loft anymore. I love it. I love it. But I'll love it even more when we expand for our family. Right. Uh, you know that adoptions take a while, right? I know. But if we buy now, then it will be ready whenever we get our perfect little boy or girl. Right. Okay. I mean, unless... I mean, you haven't changed your mind about adopting, have you? No. Oh. No, no, I can't wait. I, I, I can't wait. I'm just, it's my parents, and they're, they're, they've gone missing. They're, I just don't know where they are, and I just, I hope they're all right. More oh, than all right. Especially now we're back in Pine Valley. Uh, um, you and my friend. <laughs> I'm only doing this because the doctor here says it's a matter of life and death. doing here the patient is in critical condition i need you to tell me what to do or else we're going to lose the patient for good
change this course you're on, you were going to lose the only person who can save you. Yourself. So, I see vampires. That doesn't make me crazy. No, vampires are very uh, popular. I saw them before they were trendy. But the only crazy thing is, I feel like I know you. Like, I, I've lived here before, but I, I can't remember when. It's like I've been homesick for a place that I, I didn't remember until I came here and realized that this is the place. Does that make sense? Um, no, but oddly enough, I understand what you mean. Pine Valley is just that kind of town. I remember when I left here, I was so homesick for so long, and I think uh, I'm going to miss it again all over again when I leave. But you can't leave. You're the only person that can help me. Oh, no, there's great doctors here. You're going to be in wonderful hands. Okay, well, don't forget to tell them I'm Eric Kane's daughter. Yes. It's so good to be home. I was just saying the same thing. Oh, Mom. Oh, <laughs> And so, in Hawaii, Sam was saying to me that I ought to reopen the Glamorama as a sex party. Oh, my goodness, <laughs> turn me inside out. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, he's in the hospital. Uh, at, what? No, at the hospital. Oh. Uh, with uh, David Hayward, you know, uh -huh. incarcerated. Uh, well, Angie asked Joe to return to um, be a temporary consultant. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Wait, 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 wait. Does that, does that mean that you're going to... Joe and I are moving back to Pine Valley. <laughs> you earlier. Oh, How are you? Oh, what a surprise. So good to oh, see you. Me. So good to see you guys. Oh, How are you? I'm great. Maria actually has a patient in the ICU and I asked her to come in and give a consult. Oh, really? Yes. Any chance of your coming back permanently? I mean, having you back on staff would be quite a coup. You have no idea how much I would love to. I miss Pine Valley so uh -huh. much. But I've got my practice there. The kids are settled. So I really, I really can't. But Oh, I'm sorry. It's kind of an important call from Miami. Um, I will check back with you guys and say goodbye before I leave. Yeah, okay. Perfect. All right. Good to see you. Okay. Good to Bye, see you. We'll count on it. Wow. Huh. Dixie, Maria, you and Ruth. <laughs> yeah. You know that feeling I had right after surgery that everything was going to be incredible. Oh, sure. Well, it's happening. Something weird going on around here. I'm just thinking. What are it. you on about? Think about it. I mean, how much can one guy take? I mean, first, you know, you're home, and then Kara gets a green card. Yes. Amanda survived her, her cancer, and her I mom know. and dad are moving home. Incredible, isn't it? It's weird. It's weird. Something is going on around here, you what? know. To keep this up, I'm going to need medication. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop. i I got plenty of faith. It's just, you know, strange. Oh. See, that's probably Joe. No, that's the other shoe. Oh. I can't believe it. I, I, was, I was just saying to myself, nobody deserves to be this happy. I can't think of anyone who deserves it more. <laughs> <laughs> You're hurting me. <laughs> Listen, I pushed the drugs like you said. But they had no effect. Conscious? Yes, but the vitals are very weak. David, if you could just tell me what to do, well, I can... Just, that's just it. I can't just tell you what to do. It could be one of a million reasons. If I can't see for myself, there's no way for me to know for sure. Well, short of breaking you out of here, I doubt that's going to happen. And that's exactly what I have to make happen. Now that you're back, everything's going to be fine. My father's been messing with you. What are you talking about? You brought my mother back. And Zach and Greenlee. He hates me, but... They tried. I think it just didn't work. 
You would know in your heart if I was alive, Jr. You don't know what it's been like since I lost you. I got sick. I almost died. And my father left. I lost the house and the company, and they took our son. Took our son. I can't let him win. Look at me. You have to let it go, please. Please just remember what a good man you are. Trying to help you. You can't. Why not? Because you I just I wanted to see my family. Thank God for that. Oh, Joe! Our oh, very oh, own oh, Vera. Oh. Welcome home. Thank you to yeah. both of us. Right. Yes. yes. <laughs> oh. How are you? Can I? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> oh, Chad. You and Dixie. Yep. True love will always find a way. It may take a while. There is that. Yeah. The Martins together again. Wow. Well, it's just a temporary job. Well, well, wait, we'll see about that. Oh. I have to tell you one thing we've learned, though. Life moves too fast. And we can't slow the passage of the days, but we can choose who we spend them with. Yeah. Huh? And isn't that the truth? Well, some of those best days are preserved right uh, here, here in this photo album. album. Oh, if you want to see, come over oh, here, Jamie. Somebody get something to drink. See what you've been missing. Oh, my. Judging from the idiot grin of my son, uh, something tells me that you put it there. Dad and I have never been happier. And that says a lot. I'm so glad to hear that. Just seeing all my children happy here. Settled with the ones they love. It's all I've really wanted. Could you just excuse me for one little tiny yes, second? Sure. <laughs> you have been blessed with a miracle. Don't I know it? And I think it's a good idea to celebrate the fact every day for the rest of my life. Starting today. Huh? Uh, <laughs> yes, I certainly am. Why don't we go back to the hotel, check in, you'll get some rest, and then we'll come back. One of them's missing. You told me I could have that one. Remember? Gonna renege on that promise, too.